Hello shooters, Tim here. I wanted to share with you the stud magazine and also the loader and feeder systems. And many of you know that I use JTS Dead Center 22 grain pellets at 50 yards and I use the 45 grain and 30 caliber at 100 yards. Everything I do with the 22 will pertain to the 30 cal as far as the stud magazines go and the feeder. Um, the first thing to do is just like it says, pour the pellets and shake. And what will happen is very quickly these will fill each slot. Put your finger over this little indentation here and just shake. And you can see how quickly, in less than 10 seconds, it filled up. And then you just pour the remaining through that slot. Okay, and now it's ready to go into the loader. And this is a very simple process. There's a lip right here. The lip goes over this slot. Like that. And just turn it up. Upside down. Give it a shake. And there you go. Now these are ready to go into the magazine. Which is the next step. And it's got very good magnets, but you just slip this off. Advance the feeder or the loader to one end. And well, let me show you something. I skipped this step by accident. Let's see. Okay, once you get this filled, you can carry this around like with this lid on and nothing's going to fall out or anything. Now when it comes time to load the magazine, you want to open that little hole There you go. Until you see one pellet, dump it out in your hand. Then advance the magazine one full rotation. And stick your pellet in. And that will hold everything in place. Okay. Then you come over here to your loader. Screw the top off. Put the magazine on top. Turn it over. And there you go. A full magazine. And then you just... You see how that just pops on? And this magazine's ready to go to work, either for practice or in competition. I want to thank everybody for watching this. I wanted to show you how what a nice system this is. It doesn't bind when it loads pellets. It's, it's fantastic. Doug, you did a good job, buddy. Thanks for watching.